Hi, I'm Lieutenant Colonel Alex Reagan. I'm the JRTC Fort Johnson Installation Director of Psychological Health. And I'm here to talk to you today about services that we offer in behavioral health uh, across our installation. Starting with the continuum of care, uh, we have non-medical counseling services, 18 military family and life consultants that work both in our schools. They're located at the ACS, Army Community Services Center. And then there's also some that are aligned to our units, like 509th, 519th, 310, 46. Um, however, if you happen to be a soldier who is not in one of those units, you can go to the Army Community Services. We also have 18 chaplains and 18 chaplain assistants that also offer behavioral health services. A lot of them are aligned to the units as well, and you can also see them down at the chapels that we have here on the installation. Focusing more on the medical side, because I'm also the chief of behavioral health, I mean, we have locations both on the sixth floor of the hospital, and we have a location out at the Embedded Behavioral Health Clinic located in the 310 footprint at Building 1170. Talking about the services we offer to our 310 soldiers, everything from individual counseling to group counseling to walk-in services for somebody who just may be struggling in the moment. They can walk in anytime between 7.30 in the morning and 16.30 in the afternoon, Monday through Friday. And then up here on the sixth floor is where we offer services for all the other units on our installation and also our family members. Their hours of operation are also 7.30 in the morning until 16.30 in the afternoon, Monday through Friday. We offer the same services that I mentioned at 310 EBH, which is both group services, individual, uh, we have family counseling, we have services for our children, um, and we also have the walk-in services where somebody who may be struggling with something just today and they want to come in and be seen. The biggest message that I'd want to say about the services that we have to offer here is that there is no closed door. So whether you go walk in to see a chaplain, you walk in to see a marriage and family life consultant, or we call them MFLAX, over at ACS or in the units, or you walk into the Embedded Behavioral Health Clinic, or you come up to the sixth floor, um, we're all gonna come and talk to you and see what's going on. Once we hear a little bit about what might be going on for you that brought you in to see us, then we'll help get you connected to the most appropriate best service for you, which could be right where you showed up, or it could be working with one of the other services that I mentioned here today. If you're struggling in the moment and you're not really sure where to go, and it might even be during those hours that were not open, I want to always make sure that you know about the 988 crisis number that you can either text or you can call. They're available 24 seven. They're a great resource um, if you're just needing somebody to talk to or you're going through a crisis. Um, they will also help get you connected to some of the other services I've mentioned today. In conclusion, you know, just know those resources, know when they're open, talk to each other, stay connected. Again, help is within reach and we're better together.